Um, but one thing I wanted to talk about, other than all the other things, and, and I'll probably talk about it in more detail towards the end of the stream, um, but I did want to talk about the Five Nights at Freddy's movie. I know I've been very ambiguous about it. I know I've been very mysterious about it. And it's kind of been a thing where I was hoping that there would have been, like, some schedules aligning. But I did want to say, straight up, without any qualification, I am not going to be in the Five Nights at Freddy's movie. And I know that's crushing. And I know that's disappointing. And I know there's a lot of people that really were hoping that would be the case. But I wanted to say, unequivocally, that unfortunately, I'm not. And I'll explain why. And I'll explain why. Um, look, I will explain why. And it is not anything malicious. It is not anything being snubbed. It is not anything like that. I don't want anyone to think that. So it's not anything like that. It was supposed to happen. Let's get this straight. It was supposed to happen. There was... Uh, like time that it was supposed to occur and unfortunately and I saw this coming a while away but unfortunately the Five Nights at Freddy's movie and my movie Iron Lung were being filmed at the exact same time and this was not like anything other than it just so happened to be a conflict of schedule now despite that I was trying to make it work. I was trying to make it work because I was supposed to be out there for two days and I was supposed to film with them and I was supposed to be in the movie. But unfortunately, it was one of those things where I needed every second that I had to make my movie what it needed to be. And unfortunately, even though the timing was like maybe going to line up, it was one of those things where I had to make a call because I wouldn't expect them to compromise the quality of their project for me. And just in the same way, I wouldn't expect them to come, me, I wouldn't hope, I would hope that they wouldn't expect me to compromise the project of my movie for them. So it was one of those situations where the schedule was there, but it just didn't line up. Like there was so many things that I had to do and flying out to go film for like a very short turnaround, come right back. It was just like, those were two days that I couldn't afford to lose. And it was two days, like if there was no issues with like being away for that long and traveling there could have been another day that was there and it was like i couldn't lose two days let alone more to be able to do any of that so unfortunately i am not in the five nights of freddy's movie and i'm going to die because i was not watching my power so this is uh this is just what i deserve because um well i'm not gonna make it there yeah oh, that's the thing though that's the thing it was, uh, no, it wasn't a matter of pay. It wasn't a matter of pay at all. There was, I, I, I don't think I wanted any pay. It was just not a thing that was, like, ever on my mind about it. I wanted to be in it. It was simply a matter of the schedules didn't line up. And the reason that I was, I was trying to, like, be coy about it is because I was hoping that there was going to be a situation later on. I'm about to die. There was going to be a situation later on where it could happen. But given that the movie is coming out and, like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh my god. I've never seen that before. Uh oh. oh! Well, Freddy was not happy with me. Um, no, I, I can't talk about what I would have done in the movie. I can't talk about any of that because it still obviously hasn't come out yet. But I did want to say that there's no animosity between me and the crew or Scott or anything like that. Everyone was trying their best to make it work, but it just didn't. It just didn't. And the thing is, I had to prioritize my movie. I had to. There was just, there was just so much that had to be done in the time. And for Iron Lung to be what it needed to be, I had to dedicate everything into that project. And so, unfortunately, yeah, I'm not going to be in the Five Nights at Freddy's movie. But that doesn't mean that I don't support it. That doesn't mean that I don't, uh, I, I'm not cheering for it. But it's one of those things where it's like, I, I mentioned this like way back when, when these conversations were first happening, like, last about this time last year. I was telling them that like, hey, this is really cool. I would love to make this work but I am filming a project at this exact window and I don't know, and this is me putting words in people's mouths, I don't know if they understood the level of production that I was making. Like that's 
and I'm not saying that they should have, like, how dare they not know what I'm doing? It's one of those situations where, how could they? Because obviously, I guess, I am a YouTuber, what am I really doing? But in reality, like, I have a high expectation for the projects that I make. You guys have seen me make Space and all, and Heist and, and the various other projects that I do. I pride myself in the quality that, they, that I put into them. But at the same time, it's like, yeah, I can't expect them to really acknowledge what that's going to be because in any other circumstance, it would be like, yeah, I would bend over backwards, uh, like anyone would bend over backwards to be in our movie. But it's also just like, I am, I'm making a movie too. <laughs> like, that's just it. Uh, uh, pleh, pleh. I'm making a movie too. And if you have seen the trailer for Iron Lung, which just dropped this weekend, I highly recommend you go see that as well. You will see that I am holding myself to a very high standard of quality, so 